out of the way. Move back. Please get out of the way. No quits. No quits. Please. No pictures. No, no pictures. Is that really yours? Is there any pressure? Scott, Scott, just wait. Tell us. Tell us. Okay, so what's the first question? Well, tell us about your budget. What was your budget? Uh, just a normal budget that it requires to make a movie. Nothing special. Money, things like that. Cash, Talent, credit cards. Yes. Uh, what is the meaning of all the rhythmic music that runs through no, your that's, that's movie? That's yours. That's yours. Uh, <laughs> rhythm is the natural movement of life. Just trying to be natural. Not trying to be natural. natural. We try to create a natural feeling. Why is it that your movies don't seem to have a storyline? You know, I think there. I think you know. I've heard that. I've heard that. I think there is a storyline. I mean, I don't think I've ever done a movie that didn't have. I, I think it's the process of Zen. A uh, story within no story, no story within a story. There, there's a story. You may have to look for it. It may not be an easy thing. It may not be obvious. But, but there is always a story. There's always a story. Yeah. Why is the entire movie filmed at Golden Hour? The perfect time. I, I think it gave us that. It gave us a look. It gave us the. Look, it gave us an artistic look, which makes it more interesting to watch on television. I think than filming at normal, you know, normal business hours. What well, a normal yeah. business hours? Like yeah. nine to five. Most people choose uh, to film from morning till dusk, but we we only film at the perfect moment. We wait for that perfect moment to exist, and then we choose to film at that time. Yeah, yes. it's usually golden hour. Golden hour, we would call it. Yes. Do you make other films in this style? Uh, I, you know, I think I think we've made two films so far in this style, and possibly. Um, a Zen Western. A Zen Western, Zen Western, perhaps, yes. Do your movies contain hidden meanings? Uh, if, 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 what's the question again? <laughs> Do your movies contain any hidden meanings? You know, I, th I think they're so hidden I haven't found it. Have you found it? Uh, no, I haven't. And, and if it's hidden, then it cannot be found. Uh, yes. Yeah, so, so if it's hidden, we'd never find it. Never... There probably are meanings. Um, how is Karen Black to work with? She's great. She's Karen, great. Karen Black is great, great fantastic. Great actress. Great She's actress. Fantastic. Yes, uh, she, she really has a, a large concept of reality, and our reality is very close to her reality. Very close. And uh, thus we merge together and move together quite well. Yeah, I believe so. 69. Uh, hmm. Do you ever release copy, copies of your screenplay? Screenplay. Uh, photo play, perhaps? Uh, well, a photo play is usually written after, after the movie is made. We feel, we feel the movie is kind of like the Bible. You have to live it before you can write it. So we normally don't write the script in advance. Right, so right, right at about this point, he'll come up with me and shoot the light bulb out of the side of the black and I'm going to go right here. Right. So, I hear and see the interest of you coming. No, no, go ahead, Ken. You don't have to jump over this. Maybe, maybe right over here. You can't jump in. Yeah, it's okay. So, oh, so, so, so as, as you're coming, I remove the sword. Okay, so, yeah, so, so, I'm going to be right here. So, two, right here. Uh, so, so, yeah, right here. Right, the is gonna hit you in the back of the head. Don't break the back. Yeah. Uh, 
Yes, Clark. You mean my sister that became your sister? Yes, our sister, sister. Uh, what does she mean uh, by, uh, uh, what does she mean by that? What does rollerblade mean? Rollerblade. Donaldo. I, I think it's another. It's a, it's a Zen term, I think. It's movement with a blade, usually a samurai sword. Right. And it's a continual path, it's usually carrying a weapon of some sort. Yes. Transcendental, a path of enlightenment, the circular path of enlightenment, and uh, blade. It's obviously on. Exactly, and a sword. The samurai sword, a spiritual yeah, weapon. Where was your movie filmed? Uh, outside and inside. That makes sense. In and out. In and out. seen him around today. Yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. With all of those fathers, sisters, and uh, you know, family things, is, is, is this a spirit guide? Is it a spiritual film, or is it a family film, or is it a spiritual family film? Yeah, I, I think, I think all, all movies are spiritual. Maybe perhaps ours is more spiritual. Life is a spiritual process of awareness, and thus we reference that in the film. So is this guerrilla filmmaking at its best? It's guerrilla filmmaking in the mess. The art of guerrilla filmmaking. Hide everything. We consider it Zen filmmaking. Uh, not not guerrilla filmmaking, but Zen filmmaking. What yes. is the difference between guerrilla filmmaking and Zen filmmaking? Uh, gorillas are animals, I believe. I, with Zen, you need less gorillas. <laughs> <laughs> Why such strange editing with like the same uh, what, repetition? Strange? What's strange? What's strange about it? Yeah. The repetitious shots. Perhaps oh. a glorification of that moment. I think that's what we were doing cinematically. We were just, you know, enhancing and glorifying that particular moment in time. Excuse me, but why wasn't there more skating? There wasn't skating in the movie. I think, uh, I think there was some. There's skating. some skating. There's some. some, skating. some, there's, some right. there's some skating. On rollerblades. Like, again, a, a motion movement, a movement yeah. towards enlightenment, towards yeah. that cosmic purpose. Yes, I would think so. So why do you answer your phone reproduction? That's what we're doing. We're reproducing images. Is it true that there's been terrorist threats since you started this movie? Uh, there have been threats against both filmmakers. That's why I'm here. Um, we found out that most of the major studios feel threatened by the type of filming that these two individuals are doing. And uh, we also know that some of the we don't want to use the word, but some of the uh, labor organizations also feel threatened by these filmmakers. And uh, 
there have been threats against these two filmmakers. Can you share with us your form of security, your plan? Your Mostly it's just allowing the public to have access to these filmmakers for them to make their, their statements to spread their message, but we do not want to um, allow these, these individuals to get closer. So we try to screen visually without physical screening to isolate, to make sure that no one's going to make an actual threat. We know that there have been some very serious threats made against these two filmmakers, and we take them seriously. We take all threats seriously. Thank you. How does someone become a disciple of well, a master uh, of that, light? That's a complicated issue. Uh, I'm a disciple of the masters of light. Mark thinks you would. Yeah. I mean, uh, we, we can. Uh, well, I think uh, perhaps we, we've demonstrated a disciple so qualities. The process. Uh, the process is quite simple. Yes. Uh, is that going to fit her? Isn't that somewhat degrading, though? Uh, degrading? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> exactly. So. Each his own. I see. Yes. Yes. And. Uh, this is how you become a disciple of uh, the Masters of Light. Yes. Well, I'm sure you have lots of takers, I mean, lots of uh, converts, I mean. I mean. Uh, yeah, so there, there is some, there is a certain degree of that, yes. What is the meaning of Zen? Uh, the meaning of Zen is the meaning of Zen. Okay. Yes. Well, In both is, cases. In both cases, I yes. Why does Hawk wear a wetsuit during his holy water purification? Uh, it's, it's a cleansing process. The whole holy water essence is uh, about cleansing, and uh, one must be protected while they are cleansing. Yes. What Perhaps advice do you have? What advice do you have for actors? Uh, don't do theater and don't study. The thing to document. My actors getting ready, not me. You got it. Thank you. Has Donald O. invented a new dance? Do you believe he's invented a new dance? I think we, I think we reinvented an old dance, which uh, will probably be perceived as a new dance in time. Yes, I, w I would think so. Are you, um, are you planning to make any more movies in this style? Uh, no, we're not. What advice do you have for other filmmakers? Uh, watch our movies. <laughs> Good Why is there so much camera movement in your movies? Uh, the motion and the movement of life. Continual. I mean, uh, life never stops. Your heart never stops or you're no longer alive. Yes. Who are the graduates of Rollerblade High? The graduates of Rollerblade High, we have people like St. Offender. Uh, yeah, the Black Knight. Pharaoh, yes. They've all graduated. Uh, hopefully, at some point, our, our new talent discovery here will have been, become a graduate of Rollerblade High. What's your name again? Tipsy La Fabula. Tipsy La Fabula. Oh, yes, this is Tipsy. Yes. Why are there so many blonde people in your movies? I haven't noticed. Have you noticed that? Uh, is there a lot of blondes in the movies? Oh, yes, Do you sir. drink coffee? Uh, uh, cafe mocha. Cafe mocha, but not regular coffee. Do you think the Pope would approve of Father Donaldo? Uh, the Pope would obviously approve of something that's a spiritual yes. being. Yes. The Pope is master of light. Yes. One of the number one masters of light yes. is the Pope. Yes. So thus he would approve of another master of light, yes. Uh, what is a roller cam? It's a method of uh, documenting the spatial relationships, and uh, I think it's fun to watch. Yeah. What do your movies have to do with spatial relationships? Uh, everything. Life is a spatial vision. Yeah. Well, do you think it's degrading to have a woman in a dog collar and a leash? Let's ask her. <laughs> do you feel degraded? No. Not at all. Are you jealous? Yes, desperately. I want to harness them, not a collar. I think it would be cuter to have like one. That do could be, either of you be. have a particular interest in Congos? I, know, I can't stand Congos. Congos, uh, do we have those in the movies? It's
because there are there is a scene where there's a Congo in the middle of nowhere, and I felt that there was some sort of significance with that. Basically that has to do with the spatial relationship and uh, the motion of time into space and the sound. Emergence is kind of like uh, the holy word ohm. Oh. Yes, uh, merging with the cosmic whole. Yes. Why is there uh, so much violence in the wheel zone? Uh, the wheel zone is a place of violence. At times one must find their darker side to move into higher light. <laughs> And Do you feel that violence is the, is the answer? No, we don't feel that violence no, is no, the answer. No. Violence may be a path to solve the ultimate solution to cosmic enlightenment, and some people must take that. It's the way of the samurai. I see. way to kill someone what's the best what's a, a good way to kill someone usually the neck the neck the neck anytime you can go in and get it's also you get rid of the trachea and bring this out rip in behind these muscles right here put it out that way. if you're without a weapon it's one of the quickest ways what, what is the weapon of choice weapon of choice is something you can carry quickly through any type of a, uh, like a piece of stick about yay big real solid. Mm -hmm. and we can carry it anywhere, you're not going to have to go through metal detectors. You can use it quickly to hit anywhere in this area here, or the nose, and the top of you know, the temple area, and also in here to take the person down, disable anywhere in the hands. A regular stick? Just a regular stick. About yay long, that we can carry it anywhere, keep it at a distance. And you can throw it. There's a nice heavy stick, you can throw it, you get a nice spin on it. it works out very well. You can use it in your hand, Increase the strength of your hands as far as hitting. Um, and why do you have kabuki characters in your film? Yeah, so, you know, once, once again, referencing uh, the spiritual tutelage of the samurai warrior and uh, of ancient Japan. Stick fighting. Stick fighting is a good kind. It's, uh, it's the best thing you can use. A lot of times you have metal detectors, you have problems with different problems. Disposing of a weapon, uh, guns leave uh, ballistics. A stick doesn't. Um, yeah. Excuse me. Why do the masters of light wear one red sock? Uh, one red sock. Red sock. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, do do we wear one red sock? I suppose uh, that we do. Yes, they yeah, do. I, they su do. I suppose we do. Yes. Yes, they do. If Hawk is in, is Father Donaldo Yang? Uh, yin and Yang uh, always has a bit of each other in them. So there's a bit of Yin and Yang, and there's a yeah. bit of Yang and Yin, and so it uh, works off of one another. It's a yeah. trade-off. It's like two people working at a gas station. Loads MST motor, 5.5 spiron lens cut. 5.5 spiron lens. Can you edit that together? You got it, bud. <clears throat> Can't skip it. 16 MS. Made in Japan. <laughs> oh, here, let me do a neat overlap effect here. Let's... Give me a side shot of the camera. Side shot. Okay, here we go. <laughs> and who, who are your major influences? Uh, what's your name again? Tipsy LaFell. I, 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 I guess uh, Tipsy's one of our major influences. Tipsy's a big influence, influence. yes. Yeah, uh, 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 if you did use a weapon, like, um, a handgun, would you recommend a semi-automatic or a revolver? Anything except a wheel gun. 
most of the double action automatics are the best thing. You can have all the advantages of a double action without the jamming problems. So a double action semi-automatic is the best pistol to carry. Usually a nine millimeter. What is the meaning of Zen? The meaning of Zen is the meaning of Zen. Oh, I thought you said Zen. Zen, uh, uh, that's something we can talk about Zen. later. Oh, okay. yes. Yeah, uh, who played Oni Baba? Uh, wasn't she played played by herself? I think Oni Baba was a uh, a Devil Dog Demon disciple for Mel. Yes, I would think so. <laughs>
What a view. See? Uh, I don't know if that's possible, Denali. Probably not. Yeah. Probably not. Yeah. Notice the difference. This is the this is this is the popular tea bag. Not quite as much butt exposed. This is the more conservative. That's not a tea bag. That's just a normal. This is just my butt. Oh, it's just her normal butt. It's just butt. my normal butt making it go tea. Firm body. Firm body. Hard body. Hard body. Hard body. Hard body. Very hard. Do you have any plans for any other movies? Uh, non-stop movies. No. Non-stop? Non In the same contents as they are right now? In the same continent. Continent or, no. or another <laughs> continent. Context. Well, we will the be going same. to Japan shortly, so yeah. it could, could be other continents, yes. Form and content are, Form and, are, are separate, separate. separate devices. Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys smoke cigars? Uh, uh, I think no is a good answer. No, no. <laughs> no is a simple answer. Okay, right. How about marijuana? Um, no, that's another good what answer. Is it? Mar marijuana is uh, something I've heard about. I've heard about. Not we've, we've heard about this thing. LSD. Uh, let's stay drunk. Oh, LSD. LSD. Let's stay drunk. Let's stay drunk. Yeah, right. Dipsy knows about that. Selling something? I mean, <laughs> what about mushrooms? Uh, there's a place called the Mushroom Ranch. Good place. Good place. Place of enlightenment. We've uh, worked with Karen Black there. Yes. Yes. Karen Black uh, and the Mushroom Ranch. Is that it's how it got its name? Yes. Well, one would think so. Yeah. But in reality, probably not. Where is the mushroom ranch? It's out west. Was the spirit guide really your spirit guide? The spirit guide is the spirit guide of us all. So uh, we were simply blessed enough to have uh, met her in the physical being. All right, spirit guide going beside you now. Lose it, Hawk. Fall down. Fall. Whoa, shit. Oh, God. Oh, all right. Okay, that's good. Now try and help him up, guys. Help him up. Help him up. Come on, help him up. Very good. Now stand him up. Stand him up. Okay, now, now start going again. Get him in position. In position. Okay, keep going, guys. Skate back, Steve. Skate back. Stay in. Get a lateral going. Get in there, Spirit, guys. Help him out. Join the path of righteousness. Start seeing the path of righteousness now, Hawk. Now you've seen some enlightenment. Now you can skate better. Now try skating better. You're getting it now. You're getting it. Good deal. Good. Wonderful. Stay with him, Steve. Do a little arc around him now. And come to rest. And he's gonna cut Perfect. That's good. That's cut. So I'll just cut that out. How'd that work for you? He may be out of film. He may be out of film. Let's we'll see his camera. No, here. No, no. Don't come back to his camera. Because I opened it up. Oh. Go again. Here we go. Stand by. Back one. Here we go. Same thing. Lose it. Fall. Whoa, shit. What's going on? Okay, stay there. Stay there. Help him up, spirit guy. Help him up now. Cut. Back to one. Back to one. Let's go again. And skate. Come on. Start going. Going slow. Going slow. Fall down. Fall down. Whoa, shit. Oh, fuck. You lost it. Oh, God. Help him up, spirit guy. Help him up. Come on. He's your, he's your student here. Get back up. Reassure him it'll work. It'll work. Stay with him now, Steve. Now stay with him. Now go forward now. Skate the path of righteousness now. Stay a little wider, Steve. Go in there, spirit guy. Take him down. Show him the path. Focus in on it. Then, there we've got it. Now we've got a destiny, a focus. Go forward now, Hawk. You got it, buddy. You're skating. Go in there, spirit guy. All right. He's doing it. Well, this is wonderful. You got it. Perfect. Go in now, buddy. Now stop guys, now look at this, okay, there you go, very good. Okay, he's happy? Yes, we do. Well, let's do another one. Well, yeah. what is the meaning of Zen? Um, <clears throat> the meaning of Zen is the purest form, the purest state. The meaning of Zen is the meaning of Zen. The um, sound of one hand clapping. Is this film a, a good exhibit of CCC complete creative control? Yeah. Yes, it is. This is this is probably the, the probably one of the first examples of CCC, which is complete creative control. And you very seldom get complete creative control working in the Hollywood system. Do you well, think I, I, that think that's, I think it's about all we can do right now, you. and I think we we've Thank got to walk. You. Thank you. Thank you. Let's, let's take our new talent discovery, and we will move on. Do you have any Thanks for the questions. Thanks for the questions. Uh, do you think that the CCC is the reason of your success? Uh, CCC is the only reason of anything. What is the meaning of this? And, and when do you think that your movie is going to be out in the theater? Uh, soon, soon. Yeah. I, th I don't think you need to go beyond if you reach that point. Well, okay, you're there, but I'm there. But we're there now? Yes. How long did it take you to do that? A period of three, four months. 
you started studying three or four three or four months ago. You know, now, now you've attained cosmic consciousness. Yes, and it was there. It was always been there. Now I understand all that is. And like, you understand all that is. Yes. Now I want to become that which I know I am. Okay, now let's, let's, let's let him ask this question. Re rephrase the question one more time. Once you reach all consciousness that you know that is, how do you become that which you know you are? You already are that. No, but I'm not. No, you think you're not. But you already are. Then how do I go about achieving it and become that which I am? That you are what you are. But I know that I am, but how do I reach the... There's focal points that one must need to touch. That way it can take them to a higher, you know... That way, all the physical you're, form... You're looking for a method. The path to enlightenment holds yes. no method. There is no method. It's simply instantaneous samadhi, satori, nirvana. It happens in a moment. One can't think about it because you're rationalizing the path you're leading. You can no longer rationalize it. You just have to live it and become it. Stop thinking. So just allow path. it to be. You allow it to be. You are. It's a matter of being. Cool. Thank you. Excuse me. Well, okay, one more question. One then. more question, <clears throat> then we've got to go. What's the meaning of zen? Ask him. Okay, ask that guy back there. Just take your camera right back there. Scott Disley. Yes, yes. With every woman's fantasy. We got the legs, Sergio. We got the legs. I'm a soft. She's on the bus. <laughs> this one. This <laughs> one. the interview? Yes, these are people that, that, that chose to follow the path. That's right, yeah. follow the path of the life. knowledge it hasn't happened it hasn't happened with guys that have had a hundred million dollar budget and is this a reason for your success of the movie we're not we're worried about success of the movie uh, success is a relative think statement any, yeah thank we're, you yeah what is the meaning of Zen